devices from auto companies, but two, most all of the auto batteries in the world are made in China, and that gives them a competitive edge in battery pricing. The real question is, can the Chinese use their edge in lower cost batteries to catch up on the edge uh, Tesla has in manufacturing and uh, software? One of Tesla's key strategies in holding a significant portion of the EV market is its diverse and compelling product lineup. From the Model S to the Model Y, each vehicle showcases Tesla's commitment to performance, range, and unparalleled driving experience. The truth is that Tesla's brand has become synonymous with EVs and cutting-edge technology, and the automaker's ability to establish a strong and aspirational brand image has played a critical role in attracting a loyal and ever-growing customer base. Locally, despite the recent dips, many stock investors and analysts are still hopeful that Tesla stock will outperform the market. Why have all these stock analysts remained bullish on Tesla despite the tough market conditions? You better keep watching to find out. And Steve's got a great grasp on the data. He's talking about 54% of production coming out of China. But it raises the question of, well, hold on, what if you cut back in China as well? Yeah, I mean, when we're looking at what a near third drop in shipments for the month of July coming from China. Steve, make this global for us for a moment, because they don't just produce in China. Yes, it's been a key area of focus, but they produce largely in the US, also in Germany. They're looking to expand. How much are we going to see a curtailment of overall production or indeed a curtailment in overall profitability globally here? Well, two points. One, Tesla loves producing in China because costs there are so low. But you'd be foolish not to be aware of the geopolitical concerns on the horizon. And that's why doubling down on the capacity size in Berlin, expanding capacity in China, and about to break ground this month with a new plant in Monterey, Mexico. So Tesla's not stupid, but they're diversifying. They're going to other markets like Mexico where they can uh, enjoy the benefits of lower cost vehicles. But I must say, I, I think Elon having survived the tough times five, six, eight years ago, where it wasn't even sure the company would survive, He's focused like a laser on making sure he has a cost advantage over the others. I think he's going to squeeze a lot of the new incumbents. And I think what you're going to see very quickly is this big global shakeout again between Tesla, who's sitting on top. The Chinese will come in quickly with very low cost batteries and uh, Volkswagen, which is probably the other Western brand that I think has done the best at uh, modernizing, bringing battery production in-house and improving manufacturing capabilities. Tesla's culture of innovation is deeply ingrained. The company's willingness to push boundaries and challenge conventions has led to breakthroughs not only in electric vehicles, but also in energy storage and renewable solutions. Tesla's roadmap includes the Cybertruck, the expansion of its charging network, as well as the continued advancements in autonomous driving technology. And as we gaze into the crystal ball, it's clear that Tesla's journey is far from over. Hey guys, welcome back to Tesla Tomorrow. Tesla's recognized early on that for its electric vehicles to truly take off, it's a robust charging infrastructure which is at the heart of it all. For this reason, the automaker has entered the supercharging network. And then it turned out to be a game changer that eased range anxiety and made long distance travel in EVs a reality. Similarly, Tesla's FSD technology encompasses advanced driver assistance features and the promise of full self-driving in the future. And its continuous over-the-air updates have demonstrated the company's commitment to refining and expanding these capabilities. This is what sets Tesla apart from other companies, but only a few people actually realize this. As we carry on with the video, we're going to explore how Tesla has managed to establish its dominance over a substantial portion of the electric vehicle market. So let's rev up our engines and embark on a journey through Tesla's remarkable rise to prominence. But before we carry on, if you like this type of content, hit that like button, subscribe, and turn on post notifications to keep up to date on everything going on with Tesla. Tesla's ability to anticipate industry trends and adapt to changing consumer preferences has been a driving force behind its market dominance. As we navigate the road ahead, it's evident that Tesla's role in the electric vehicle market is poised to continue its growth trajectory and the company's commitment to sustainable transportation and technological innovation remains unwavering. About 6.6 .6 million global EV purchases were recorded in 2021, from 3 million a year previous. This shows that there is an increase in demand for electric vehicles, which may signal a massive shift to clean energy. 
In the past decades, the demand for EVs has increased tremendously, and now more than ever, more people are buying and using them. Most Tesla bulls believe that this increase in EVs will have a positive effect on Tesla car sales and demands. In a recent interview with CNBC, CEO of Gerber Kawasaki Wealth and Investment Management, Ross Gerber, said that there's no need to be bearish on the idea of electric vehicles, since this is fast becoming the new trend. The switch to electric cars is happening quickly, and a lot of people as well as countries are beginning to see the potential benefits of using clean energy. Places like Australia have enforced policies to promote the sale and use of electric cars. More people are starting to consider actually going for electric vehicles, and that is a good thing. According to analysts, there is an increase in demand for electric vehicles, at a rate that has never been seen. This is because electric vehicles are proving to be better alternatives to ICE cars in terms of promoting clean energy. Tesla has been in the EV business for years, and during this time, it's expanded its markets and increased sales through improved technology and scaling of its revenue. With the current and expected trend in the use of electric vehicles, think of what the future will be like for EV companies, stocks, and especially Tesla. Several analysts are very optimistic about the future of the EV market, and this will be of great benefit to Tesla since its leading electric car company is actually going to be a huge deal. And it's now got a wider market compared to other EV makers. The automaker already has a high demand for electric cars, and it may even have more with the expected surge in the demand for its electric cars. Wall Street analyst Pierre Faragou once said that Tesla is facing unprecedented demand. He even said that after visiting Tesla's Berlin Gigafactory, a lot of people agree that EV demand is way above what is expected a few years ago, adding that since electric cars have become popular, market shares for Tesla and its competitors may be dictated by their ability to ramp production volumes. He believes that if Tesla can successfully meet the rising demands, its stock price can go as high as $530 in the future, and Tesla may be worth $10 trillion by 2030 if it's able to produce 20 million EVs per year by that time. Coupled with the increasing demand in Tesla cars, the car maker is trying to cut costs, especially with batteries. Even though the automaker's already cut its Model Y battery costs by up to $3,000 by using large cells, it still intends to cut costs further by using a dry coat process for its 4680 cells. Tesla has led the electric vehicle industry for years, and is going to keep on outselling its peers while maintaining those higher margins in order to stay ahead of other car companies. If at any point in the future Tesla is able to reduce cost of its batteries, then the automaker will be unstoppable. Tesla's financial stability has allowed it to invest aggressively in research and development, production facilities and other growth initiatives, solidifying its position as a market leader. It's also enabled it to quickly expand. Tesla's research extends far beyond its California headquarters. Its global expansion efforts, including manufacturing facilities in China and Germany, showcase the company's commitment to capturing international markets, and it is in this way that it will completely dominate the industry eventually. But what do you think? Let us know down below. And if you want to know more about what Tesla's been up to over the last few days, go ahead and click on this next video on your screen. See you there.